This company was getting struck off at a smart limited, yeah? Right. Getting struck off on company's house. And um, I'm ready for it, yeah? You know the day it's going to Yeah, get well, off. so, yeah, then got a new account, and I said, I want to go limited. This is the name I'm going to use. And he said, you can't use that. I said, Kelly, it's on company's house. It's available, you know, it's been struck off. It's dead, yeah. No, no, someone has registered it. <laughs> I said, what? Nobody's registered art of smart, have they? They went, yeah, yeah, do you, you recognise the address? Mm-mm-mm-mm. <laughs> it was a dress, was it? So yeah, me and this guy was obviously chatting a little bit. He used to go to pub and stuff, and he'd, he'd kind of lost love with his job a bit. So I was like, mate, I've had an idea, yeah? Why don't mean you start a business? He said, what? I said, well, you obviously know about Control Far. I know about everything else. Mm-hmm. I want to do this. My boss don't want to do this. Let's start it's a business. To, let's start a business yeah. together. Yeah. So he used to meet up at a pub on a Thursday. <laughs> Yeah, every, every, that, that, every Thursday I used to meet up at the pub and I'd say, right, between now and next week, because I said to him, I'm in a comfortable job. Mm-hmm. I'm in 50, 60 grand a year. Mm. You know, I've got a van full of all the tools, stock materials I want. I'm not leaving this business until I've got a van. I'm not having a shitty van. I want a brand new lease van. Yeah. If you're going to do image. it, you need to make I sure want it's tools. Proper. I want a little star room. Yeah. I'm, I'm making the jump organization and prep. I want everything <laughs> in place. You know, that too. I want it all in place. I want all my ducks in a row. So then we obviously formed the company, but in his name. Right. Because I was employed and I didn't want to rock that boat yeah, or yeah. Yeah, get yeah, done when yeah. I left him. So then, yeah, so he used to meet up on a Thursday. After about three Thursdays, I thought, nah. He's not bothered. Oh. He's born idle. Right. So he used to meet up on a Thursday. He just wants to go to the pub on a Thursday. Basically. Pretty much, yeah. You no, know, he just want to start a business, don't work for this company anymore. Yeah. But he's, not, he's as... not got, he's been employed all his life. He's not got that business No drive. Mindset, he has no drive. Yeah. So we met up on a Thursday. You used to meet up on a Thursday. I said, right, between now and next Thursday, you do X, Y, Z. I'll get X, Y, Z ready. Yeah. Cool, cool, yeah. You used to meet up on a Thursday. Oh, have you got on? Ah, didn't really have time this week to get anything done. Mm. I yes. don't know how because you work nine to five, mm. but I'm working like 80, 90 hour weeks. And I'd go, I've done X, Y, Z. And I've done this as well. Yeah. Like literally, I'm, I'm, this is, I'm, I've been ready for this for three years. Yeah. He's done nothing. So then I fizzled it out. Yeah. Now he actually then got made redundant from Control Far, mm-hmm. and then he comes to me. He's like, "Right, mate, I've, I've lost my job. We need to get going." Too little, too late. I'm like, isn't it? no. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, no, no. But he's my best mate. He was actually my best mate. Mm-hmm. So then we started getting things going again. Right, let's go pop on a Thursday then. Well, let's yeah. go Tuesday and Thursday and really get things made. So I used to meet up with him on Thursday and be like, "All right, I've done X, Y, Z, and that." Blah blah. We got you. Oh, I've not really had time. But still, still. But you've not got a job now. Yeah, now you haven't got a job. No, you've got, got no excuses and you still can't be asked to do it. Yeah, yeah that's, that's, uh, right that's the major flag. redundant. That's yeah, a red, red flag, flag right there, definitely. But, so, it's still kind of going and whatnot now because we'd planned a date to go to, for me to leave mm-hmm. and I kind of had this date lined up. I had work lined up. Like I said, I'm not, I'm not doing this with no work lined up. I had a job at hairdressers, a dentist in town, changing the fuse boards and doing an ICR, which is an electrical test. I had it lined up. Now, it wasn't ready to jump by that point. Right. But I've got this work lined up. Mm-hmm. I used to do a few govies here and there. So I had to do them as a gov. Govies a private job. Well, yeah, so yeah. Moonlighting. Moon that was moonlighting. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, so I'm doing this job and whatnot. And now I was, this was a big job to do on a night. So yeah. I got some lads in from work. They used to work with me. I was on a 200 quid to come work with me it's on like Saturday. like doing filming outside, Craig, isn't it? Yeah. Basically. Yeah. It's fine. I'm, I'm yeah. cool with it. And to be fair, my old boss used to be cool with me doing it. Mm-hmm. To be fair, this what I did here bringing out lads in on Saturday was semi piss take. Um, <laughs> but it was what it was. Yeah. And again, everything happens for a reason. So what happened on that day? My boss must have looked at his trackers one day on a Saturday, randomly. Oh, it's far of my vans in town. Uh, uh, oh. Uh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and this was the beginning of the end, so... There was a knock on the door where I was working. It, a oh, dentist, literally? There was a knock on the door, a dentist salon in town, yeah? You've never heard this story, you're going to love it. No. <laughs> you're going to love it, I loved it. Um, I really loved it. Now, a little bit before this, I tried actually, no, ah, this is, I missed a bit. I tried handing my notice in. Right. Oh, okay. Because I had this day. Yeah, yeah. And like, no, we're not accepting your notice. Well, can't you can't mean. not, not accept my notice. It was like, tell us whatever you want. No, because me leaving like, would have been detrimental. Yeah. It's yeah, a big yeah. problem that's, me that's leaving. not good. It's a big problem me yeah. leaving. It's like if any of you left. It's <laughs> detrimental. You're dead to me. <laughs> <laughs> but I was, would have been dead to him, but it's detrimental. Now, I so didn't accept it. The, the, the boss was crying, offering me more money, whatever you want. So I, I didn't have the heart to say no, accepted it, but I had this job lined up. Yeah. 
my, you, you my business, business partner has been a lazy bastard for maybe blessing these guys. Like, so it's mm. like a little longer, yeah. but I have yeah. this job. I don't like letting people down. So I'm going to do this job. So I brought lads in from work. Anyway, back to where we were. So then knock at the door. And it, can do that because it's part, part of the thing. Mm-hmm. So I'm at hair salon in town. At dentist. Knock on the it's door. Normally hair salon in town. That's where I usually am. <laughs> yeah, once a week. Once a week. <laughs> hair looks different on this. Um, but yes, yeah, so knock at the door. How the fuck's that? I says, I don't realise. I'll go down. Went down to my directors and stood there. Oh my God. I've had to door this dentist in town. There's four of their vans parked up. Branded, all signed up and whatnot. We just get our teeth checked. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I'd have, I wish I'd have been on your five mate. Scale and polish, bro. Scale and I don't polish. think I wash whenever a tool belt on and whatnot. Yeah. <laughs> I'm doing it myself. Yeah. You've not so seen these teeth, mate. They were there. Now, two bosses. In fact, I had three bosses. The original three when I started, that was sound. Mm-hmm. Then they brought a fourth director in later on, who was a dickhead. Mm. That said, that's dumb. It was. Um, he's no longer actually part of the business, apparently. But anyway, so they've done that. I'm stood outside and... Uh, Dickhead boss, gone. What the fuck's going on here? Did you not mention though? Did, did, was this completely? They didn't know about this. Like you said, you know they've done. You've done jobs on the did side. You know, I did or, jobs on the side, but they didn't know the scale. apprentices here and there. Right. Okay. Then yeah. no, you took all the vans and all the. Did all you have some my van? It was, that was cool. Oh, yeah, you've that taken was, like was cool. serious. He used to the, do the full workforce is with you, sales. basically. Right. Okay. It, it, it's cool. That was cool. Yeah, yeah. Go for it. Yeah. Um. So yeah, then he's saying that he was like, "What's going on here?" I was like, "Listen, yeah." I tried to quit my job two weeks ago mm-hmm. and you refused. I said, I had this lined up. I said, I wasn't going to let him down. Yeah. Go, li-. And what do you want me to do? The, the sound yeah. boss, the sound boss is going, man, we should have just told us, could sort it out, could sort it out. Dickhead boss, give me fucking man keys. Do you know what it is, yeah? I unclipped him off my belt. <laughs> Chuck in, him. In the middle of town, Chuck him yeah. in a drain. Honestly, I, I unclipped him. I fucking threw him out. Went, you fucking have him. <laughs> the yeah. other, so he just took my vehicle to get home. Yeah, yeah. The yeah. other boss, Pick my keys up and went, no, 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 mate, take keys. Good Good office, we'll talk about talk this. About yeah. too, Fucking mean? Jekyll and Hyde. Yeah. Well, Good we'll talk up. about this on Monday. I said, do you know what it is? Yeah. No. This was a kick up the ass I needed. You've, See, you've made my mind up. You, you, you yeah. forced my decision. Yeah, yeah. You forced my decision. I'll give you benefit of doubt. There's yeah. Van. Yeah. There's Van. See you later. Off. And now we're so it. So I took the Van and I'm inside. My heart is galloping. <laughs> I'm like, fucking, what has <laughs> just happened? Oh, lads are like panicking about their jobs. Yeah. yeah like, yeah. listen. I'm the problem. Yeah. Not you. I'm taking the entire blame for this. It, yeah. It's all yeah. me. I'm gone now, boys. And then last time, damn, I don't want to sleep. You know, cause I've taught them a lot, a lot, a lot. So yeah. mother, whatnot. And it's like, listen, it is what it is. I've wanted this. I've wanted this for three it's, years. It's done now. I've had my yeah. hand forced. Yeah. I've had my hand forced. I have to leave. So then next day, they're like coming for a chat. I was like, no. I, but I took my van with all my tools in it, all my personal tools, my hand tools, everything. It's a ransom. Basically. Coming for a chat. I ain't coming for a chat. Coming to get me tools. I won't just want my tools. No, you need to come for a chat. You can't steal my tools. Yeah. You still have hands and stuff on a weekend. Didn't steal. Them, didn't but... steal them, but I get your point. <laughs> I lended so they wouldn't give me my term. tools back. Um, so I just went out and bought new ones. Um, I went really? out. I had no van. I had no vehicle. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't even have a personal car for five years because I was working every day. I just had yeah, a van. The, the kind enough to let me use it on the weekend. Um, and uh, yeah, so I had no van, no vehicle, no nothing. I literally went out and bought a fucking five hundred pound, so I could afford. Yeah, because now savings ready for it. Because it's dropped cause on it you. Dropped yeah, on yeah. me. Yeah, bought a five hundred pound van. Mm-hmm. Piece of shit. Yeah, Red say, no, Fifteen quid. years old. My old work lads uh, won't quite Photoshop. Or what. And I used to have. I've always got cats. Yeah. I used to have um, cats two savannas. I used to have two savannah cats. And uh, my old work, lads, I'll see if I can find out my phone. It, I'll give you credit, whoever made it. It was brilliant. Obviously, this was going around in some fucking work group still. It was Postman Pat and his Bengal cat. Wow. And a Photoshop of me. In your ma- van. No, with Postman Pat's van. With a Bengal cat sat on the passenger seat. <laughs> it was brilliant, yeah. Found funny side. But uh, when mm-hmm. I left, obviously, because of the way that I left, I also said no contact with him. Right. And I had some real good mates at work. We literally had no contact. It was like, Even no, because they all laughed like, at me. Yeah, yeah, they yeah. Laugh, it was all laughing at me because, oh, smart arms, yeah. Good luck with your shitty fucking van doing smart arms. Just you wait. Yeah. Mm. Basically. But I had this other job on hairdressers. Whitey 2 rewiring hairdressers. I mean, this guy, my business partner, doing this job. And we're doing it. And to be fair to him, he brought another job in. We did a rewire. Obviously, I'm an electrician. I've got, I've got to do work. Mm-hmm. Facebook and Instagram posting that we're doing these jobs. Was that the one that's on the Instagram? 
it's like the there is second, a there is a picture uh, of him somewhere. Yeah, no, yeah. The, you uh, the, 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 hair, the hair salon. The hair salon. It's like, yeah, it's like the post. second post. Second yeah, post. Yeah. If you scroll right back on Instagram, yeah. you did it because my yeah. missus Charlotte. Yeah, she's she was with me before all this, mm. and I remember a day sat in my next door neighbor's house when I come home from this incident, because I tell them I want to go self-employed. My loving neighbours, Pete and Sandra, have watched me do my house up for two years. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. You know, blown away by the tech I've put in it, which is <laughs> yeah. nothing at the time. Um, they've watched all that, and I'm sat in the living room, and I'm going, fucking hell. <sighs> They're like, mate, it's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. I was like, yeah, but I wanted this fucking brand new van. And I've got this. They're like, mate, it's a van. It's a van. Get as long go- as it moves. Literally, yeah. get going. It's going to be fine. <clears throat> so... Was this under, just to quickly, was this under like Rich Heppel AV guy or was so, this under any well, kind of oh, smart? Well, that actually talks, brings out the beginning of the end, my business partner. Right. So, yeah. you, so you're just Rich Heppel at this well, point? This was fucking Mom nothing. This was, don't have a clue. This yeah. was this was a guy in a van with invoice to go, <coughs> didn't have a clue is what this was. Right. But um, I'd registered the name at Smart. I'd come up with this 12 months ago. Uh, okay. Trying to think of business names, but it's registered in my business, business partner's name. Right. So I didn't want to come right, through to yeah. me. So then anyway, I got some applied or oh, um let's get this sorted, let's get the company sorted. Let's let's right, fuck it, we're gonna Make go it official. properly. Went on company's house, it said um notice of not filed doc you've got to file documents once a year. Mm-hmm. He'd not filed the documents and it had a notice of strike off. So the company doesn't exist. Basically. No, but they strike it off and it's free from. Yeah. Notice of strike off. I said, Paul. I said, What the fuck's this? This needs to start. Oh yeah, I'll find let him do it. Find let him do it. Fair enough. He's going to sort that. Sort that. Was going to sort it. Nothing really sorted. But how we ended up splitting up and parting ways was um, um, we'd uh, we're doing jobs. He brought this job in for his mm-hmm. cousin and or something like that, some relative. And we'd done this. It was a rewind. We needed to finish it up because was actually going to do another job next week. Couldn't go back there. Moving in. She's now eight months pregnant. I says oh, I'm going to have to work this weekend and finish this house. Mm-hmm. He says oh, I can't, mate. I said I'm off walking in lakes. Was he there on site with you physically, or was he kind of just yeah, getting yeah, the jobs in? Me. Oh, right, so he Literally, come in and just... just laboring on me. So he's on goal, yeah. he's on yeah. effectively. So he's, Literally. So he was, like, um, labouring on me for bits, and it was pretty handy, but he was a labourer. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. So then we're doing this. I was going home every night doing admin courts and that. Mm-hmm. I'd pick him up at, like, half eight, and uh, he'd be like, oh, I'm like it. I mean, I'm so fucking midnight doing courts and invoices. He didn't do anything. Yeah. Because he's so used to nine to five. Yeah, yeah. So he had like, the nine to five I'm mentality. Clock, I'm off clock, yeah. 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 So then it was like, right, when he's finished his job this weekend, I can't work this weekend, mate. So I'll go, I'll go and walk in at Lakes with Mrs. So we've got this job to finish for your eight and a half month pregnant. Yeah, but I'm going walking at Lakes. I says, if, if if you're not at your house on Saturday, mm-hmm. half past eight, ready to go to their thing, we are fucking done, mate. We're done. We're done. Yeah. Just... Hold up his house at half eight and her car. We're gone because we're to Lakes. All right. Cool. See you later. Cool. Monday, text me. Hi, mate, we're out today. So we're out today. We're fucking done. Mm. Oh, wait, you being serious? I'm fucking deadly serious. And that was it, done. And I never spoke to him again. He was my best friend. That's it. Li- yeah. Literally. That's... But, but the next problem, yeah? So I knew the day this this company did, this is, this is a shock, this is a clanger, this one. This is a fucking unbelievable clanger. Uh, this company was getting struck off at a smart limited, yeah? Right. Getting struck off on company's house. And um, I'm ready for it. Yeah, you know the day it's going to Yeah, get well, off. so, yeah, then got a new account, and I said, I want to go limited. This is the name I'm going to use, and he said, you can't use that. I said, Kelly, it's on companies out. It's available, you know, it's been struck off. It's dead, yeah. No, no, someone has registered it. <laughs> I said, what? Nobody's registered art of smart, have they? They went, yeah, yeah, do you, you recognise the address? <laughs> it was address, was it? Bladders. My old fucking employer. No. All right. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> That's okay. Because they That's understand okay. business. Yeah, I don't yeah. understand business. I'm an electrician that's just gone self-employed. I don't have a clue about oh, limited yeah. companies. Did you mention the name to them? Or did they just no, know but they've always through, searched, through your socials? They've I was on Facebook and Instagram. Right, yeah. okay. So, so they've see what you've been registered. Doing. The trade bar limited. Yeah. Well, the company name, the company's house. Wow. Four directors of the company I used to work with stole my name. Just to spite wow. you. Just to spite me. Yeah. But I was a sole trader, so it didn't really matter because I didn't need to be limited at that point. Yeah, yeah. I had shit accountants and shit business advice and that. And then... I got a new accountant in lockdown mm-hmm. and um, he was like, oh, well, what company name do you want? I said, well, I wanted this, but I can't use it. He said, well, you've got the trade account. Now. We've got this and that. Put group on end. So that is the actual reason we but are at a smart, smart group. group. Yeah, limited. Not because I'm a pretentious cunt and I want to make out I've got <laughs> loads of businesses because I had to because my old company registered the name. Wow. Anyway, a couple of weeks after I'd registered that and we're on that path, my, I might have seen it on LinkedIn or something like that on Facebook or whatever. But you were using it, yeah. And then... Uh, 
did, one of my old directors reached out to me and said, oh, the dickhead director is no longer with the company. We've dissolved the name so you can take it back. I don't fucking need anyone. <laughs> I am the group. <laughs> Man, literally. Yeah. yeah so I was a fight that registered the name so I couldn't use it. And again, I've got no animosity to him now, like whatever. It's done. It? It's, yeah. it's done. It's done. It's done. It's done. That's the other thing. I don't hold grudges in it. Like, yeah. it doesn't affect my life now, whatever. I'm well, over yeah, exactly. it. So on the streets tomorrow, I'd share the hand and I'll thank them for everything they've done for me. You know, I've, in fact, he probably give you the smarts going forward to be like, right, let's make sure no well, one. One of my bosses, my old bosses, one of the other Sam ones, followed me on LinkedIn about two years ago. Mm. You know, he messaged me and we're like, bloody hell, mate, very enough to well for yourself. I said, told you, you should listen to me about smarts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Legit, he went, no, it looks like you're doing really well for yourself. I said, mate, if you want to come see office with boys, come down, can, welcome to come for a coffee. He's not took me up on that. So if he does end up listening to this, you are still more than welcome that, to come for that like coffee. That's funny as well, because, um, you know, now, you know, I won't disclose anything, but like you'll mm-hmm. kind of like, oh, I've got an idea for like something else. Mm-hmm. And you're just like, I've already registered, donate, donate, and stuff like that. Because it's, it's, like, it's the first thing yeah, you do now. Yeah. yeah. Literally. Even, even, if, even was, if it's just like yeah. a, a three in the morning thought. Yeah. yeah. I'll register that, that's, that's what it is. Because yeah. like you say, it's like, yeah, the time, like, wow, why have they done that? But now you've learned from it. So come to work one day and I'll tell him I've registered, a domain. <laughs> oh, <laughs> hey, mate, yeah, I'm leaving. Yeah, what are you yeah. doing? I'm doing yeah. the. Yeah. <laughs> yeah.